Hello all, welcome back to another Chris's Beer Reviews. How are you? Hope you're doing it really well. So of course it's time for a beer review and we're off to Flock Brewery. Now the reason I'm doing this Flock beer is because a few days ago I reviewed the Cosmic Fog by Northern Monk in collaboration with Flock. Uh, and I know Flock beers are good uh, and that was good. I did enjoy that, which was a nice improvement from Northern Monk. So I thought, well, let's just get a Flock beer in and review a Flock beer. So we have, and we've got Hard Candy. It's an 8% double IPA. There it is. Funky artwork. Give that a little twirl for you. A little bit of writing on the back about hops, etc. Uh, I only read what hops are in it. Didn't read anything else. So let's get on with it. Let's have a look at this one. This came from Trembling Madness. I'll tell you how much it was in a second. Let's get it out in the glass. There she goes, all in, that might just go over the edge. No, it hasn't, good, look at how much this cost. Now this is £6.45, £6.45. Let's have a look at it then. Nice big old head. Bit kind of light chicken stock in colour. Not as hazy as I would have thought, I thought it might have been quite sort of dense on the haze, but I mean, it's, it's certainly not see-through, but it's not kind of as, as dense as I was expecting. I was expecting it to be a bit darker in colour as well. Let's get on the aromas. Citrus and fruity. Big punching citrus <laughs> all over the old tash. Big punching citrus. Stone fruit and tropical fruits. Yeah, but it's, it's quite zesty. It's got a big citrus zest to it. So let's get tasting. Cheers. Oh yes. Oh yes, please. Um, I think it's been a while since. God, yeah. Mmm. God, it's definitely been a while since I've had uh, a big punchy double, double IPA and core. That's big and punchy. I used to drink these quite a lot, and then I, I, I kind of got bored of them. I don't know if bored's the right word, but I just felt like I'd had enough of them. It was probably more straightforward. I just had enough of them. So I didn't drink them for ages, and I was just drinking a lot of uh, lagers, a lot of German lagers, and a few other bits and pieces, and I chucked in the odd IPA review here and there, but not big double IPAs. So, yeah, it's been a while since I've uh, done a big... A big double IPA at eight percent, and uh, that's pretty good. That's very good. Mm. Superb body. It's got a bubble gum, kind of type vibe to it. Massive stone fruits, massive tropical fruits, massive citrus, huge citrus vibe. But then you have kind of got that that bubble gum bubblegum type feel to it almost like sweets candy vibe it's definitely got that going on in it as well which is really really good it's got a bit of dankness to it and it's got a lovely kind of spiky bitter finish as well at the back it's um oh yeah that's good i've got the camera a lot closer to me than i normally do so you can't see my hands moving around <laughs> like they normally are they're normally always moving around aren't they but they're doing it underneath the camera uh, that is really good um, i've forgotten what a good double ipa tastes like and that's a good one from Flock. I appreciate you. How much did I say it was? 6.45. Yeah, 6.45. Um, but when they taste that good, and the mouth feels that good, and the flavours are that good, and that spiky bitter finish is that good, it's a it's a it's a good brewed beer, uh, and it, you know it probably deserves that price tag because that will you know just destroy any kind of double IPA that's in the supermarkets right now. Oh. yeah i've just forgotten what that's like it's big it's bold it's juicy it's fruity it's citrusy it's zesty candy bubblegum type vibe like bazooka you remember the old bazooka chewing gums but then with that beautiful bitter finish absolutely beautiful yeah that's fantastic uh, that is a very very nice beer indeed uh, i know flock are good i've had some of their beers before but it's been a while since i've had a biggie um 
So I could thank Northern Monk for that, and I suppose Flock would also thank Northern Monk for that, because it's because of that that I bought that. So it works, doesn't it, having your name on another beer, but that other beer had to be good, and it was. So there you go, I'm waffling now. There it is, Hard Candy, 8% double IPA from Flock, with fantastic little artwork on there. <coughs> Pardon me, I'm all done. I will see you all soon on another one. Thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate it.